Well, you know, there's not enough patients in a 500, 450 patient trial to document safety beyond a shadow of a doubt, but certainly the drug is very safe. Uh, the only toxicities we saw were related to the chemotherapy, and uh, really none that we could directly attribute to the antibody. Uh, we looked at uh, population pharmacokinetics, and they were similar, and we also looked at immunogenicity, or the ability to make anti-drug antibodies, and they were about 2.5% in both arms, which is similar to what has been reported reported for Herceptin in the past. So overall, we felt that this study demonstrated that uh, this proposed trastuzumab biosimilar is really similar and fits the regulatory guidelines for that. And so for that reason, uh, we're hopeful that submission to the regulatory agencies will be successful. In the United States, we won't be using biosimilars for a while because we still have the patent life for Herceptin.